Hi guys, welcome to how to with yet another video. I hope you all are doing good. In this video, I'll show you how to transfer your files and data from one cloud storage to another cloud storage. Sometimes you might be using OneDrive and you may want to uh, transfer all your files to Google Drive or from Google Drive to another Drive box or Dropbox, any any other services available uh, here, yeah, right? So in this video, I'll show you how to transfer, how to move all your data, files, images, or whatever uh, from one cloud service to another service, okay? So here I'm going to transfer and everything from my OneDrive uh, to Google Drive, okay? So uh, first you need to make sure that you have enough storage on your Google Drive. To check that you can go to the link in the description that uh, settings and storage option and here you can see that storage available on your account. Now I have 15 uh, gigabytes of storage uh, on this free plan so if you want you can actually choose for premium plan like for two dollars you can have 100, uh, 100 gigabyte and for ten dollars you can have uh, one terabyte of storage okay check uh, check the space available on your one drive account account you can just go to options and you can see the storage available on your account so here I have about uh, 30 gigabytes of storage available. I actually don't need to move all these files, but I'm just doing this for this tutorial. So go back. So these are the files I'm going to move, okay? So I only have uh, below one gigabytes of data on my Google Drive, so it's completely fine. I can move all the files to Google Drive. So to move, you need to use another service. So it's called mover.io I have put the link in the description you can go to that uh, website and create an account if you don't have an account okay all you needed to do is enter an e enter your email and a password uh, create a strong password okay then click create account and you will get an email from this service and you need to verify your account just click the link in the email okay so i'm going to sign in okay so this is a control panel of your mover account okay this is uh from where you move you add one account as a source and another account as a destination okay so from here you can choose accounts uh, available actually from services that this mover offer you okay. so here uh, now I'm going to add an account uh, in this case OneDrive as source and Google Drive as destination okay so you can actually choose an account from here a service from here okay select service so from here you just click new and it will pop up a new window with a uh, lots of service actually there are two categories one is personal connectors and there is another one for business accounts okay uh, majority of these services also offer business accounts separate business accounts uh, if you want to uh, move from one business account to another one you can use any of these services here i'm going to use this personal connector okay so in this case onedrive as my source click onedrive and click next you can actually choose a name for your souls so here I'm going to leave it as default okay add this connector it will ask you to log into your OneDrive account uh, you know if you have it already logged in and you will need to let that application have access to your OneDrive account it's completely safe uh, you need to give access to the service otherwise it can't move from your one drive to another this is a service available in the market now okay so click yes okay so that's been added okay then you can also access all the documents from here you can also choose which one you need to uh, move okay so here see that you can choose like this so if you want to move entire drive you can just click choose that so and here I'm going to add destination yeah. Google Drive in this case click next then add this connector okay choose the account you want to you may have several 
accounts choose the account you want to use okay so in this case this one okay here also you need to allow that application to have access to your Google Drive so click allow so in this case uh, there's no files here okay I haven't even used it so that's it now we are almost had to transfer file from one drive to another drive okay choose the files you want to move from one drive first okay here actually you have your uh, hierarchical uh, drop down list and from this drop down list you can choose which of the file you want to move so if you only want to move music files just click that music okay and choose this okay then click run that's it you can actually zip the files from your one drive so that it will zip the file like this mover and lots of numbers okay so if you want to zip your files just tick the checkbox and it will you can also schedule a transfer from one drive to google drive if you want to schedule just click schedule and choose the date week and month or whatever or even time so every hour on minute you can actually leave this here and as you said the schedule then it will automatically move all your new files to uh, google drive in this case i'm going to use run now okay so i don't want to archive these files i'm just moving all files to one drive okay so click one drive then choose here and click run so click run this transfer now uh, depending on the size of your file it'll take uh, from few minutes to a uh, few hours and here you can see that active and uh, successful and errors if there is an, an, uh, any errors it will show that errors here and here you can see the successful transfer and here you can see the active now this is the active one so it's now running behind the scene and once it's completed you should know about that here you can actually see the uh, log file and you can see the transfer ID and the name of the drives source name you can actually see the progress of this transfer here okay you can check later of course you need to uh, give some time for this application to do the job so once it's completed you should see all your files from your OneDrive on your Google Drive account okay so that's it guys that's how you transfer files from one storage to another storage so i hope this helps please subscribe to my channel for more videos tips and tricks like this and thanks for watching